What's up guys, it's Vive Chief here and welcome back to another video on my channel. Today we have for you some insane team of the week investments that are going to help you make a ton of coins on FIFA 21. Now if you are enjoying the content or you're new around here, I ask that you jump over to the channel here and hit that subscribe button. We're going to try to hit 10,000 subscribers by the end of FIFA 21, so it would be greatly appreciated if you did subscribe. And if you do enjoy live streams, please jump over to Twitch here, drop me a follow, come hang out in the streams, it's always a good time. We do all sorts of trading methods, investing, pack openings, and everything on our road to glory so you can see how we got all of this stuff for free live over on Twitch. And then if you are looking for just the best tips out there to help you make coins on FIFA 21, check out the Zinja and Footed It Up Discord in the description. Use my referral link, they're the best Discord in the community. Now, let's jump right into these Team of the Week investments. We're back with our weekly video here, guys, for the Team of the Week investments. And the first thing I wanna do here is show you the Team of the Week. Now, this is the Team of the Week this week. So let's go over some cards we're gonna kinda look at here for sure. So Lucas Vasquez, we wanna check his price. Keen, Romero, we wanna check him out. Probably DePaul, Hilaire. Um, I'd like to check Yunez, Maripen here. Stefan Mayotte. So there's quite a few team of the weeks here we're going to look at and kind of show you who to invest in, what prices to try to pick them up, at, and just how to make some easy coins. So first guy I want to show you and the guy I think is the best investment in this team of the week, and we're going to talk about him more later in the video, is it is going to be, I don't know why I'm putting him in like that, it's going to be the 84 rated inform Michael Keane. I think this guy's a really, really good investment as a Premier League 84 rated team of the week center back. I think he's going to go up in price big time in a week or two with a certain SBC or just without being out of packs going up in value. Give me that for 24k. Missed out on him there for 24k. But if you're able to pick up this Keane for 25k or under, I think that is a deal and a half. And he's 25 and a half k right now on Xbox. So I think He's a really good deal. You should definitely check out this Michael Keane. He's one of the better investments we're seeing right now. Now, into our next one here, we are going to be looking at, this is a guy I can never search, so I'm going to have to just put him in, but it's the Atalanta Argentinian center back Romero here. So we're going to go gold team of the week. It's his 84 rated card again, another center back. And if we look here, so this is his 82 rated card. We don't want to be picking up that card. We want the 84 rated version here. We invested in the 82 before in a different team of the week uh, investments video, and he went up big time. So this guy's looking to be right around the same price as Keen, possibly. Now, if he's more expensive than Ke than Keen, he's not a guy that I would recommend picking up. I think Keen's definitely the better investment out of these two, and he's looking like he is going to be a little bit more expensive right around. I mean, if you're able to get this guy for like 26, 25K, just like Michael Keen, I'd pick him up. But he's hanging out right around like 27,000, 26,250 right there. He just got bought up. But during squad battles rewards, again, if you can snipe him for like 25K, I'd definitely pick this up. So this and Michael Keane, 25K and under, I think are really, really good. Now into our next one here, going to be a strong link here to uh, to Romero that we just looked at. It's going to be DePaul here, his team of the week. Now, I, don't, I think he also has a lower rated team of the week. I'm not 100% sure. Yeah, he has an 81, but we're going to be looking at the 84 here. Now, an Argentinian center mid in the Italian league. For 84 rated, he's under 24K. I think he's going to be really good value. No, this is not a guy I would mass stock. Now, Michael Keane is a guy that if you wanted to, you could go all in on him and just make tons and tons of coins. This DePaul guy, he'd be a guy that... If you just wanted to get like one of each of these team of the weeks and put them in the club, I'd definitely go and get him. But again, if you're going to mass stock some of these guys, hold them on your transfer list, go on a sign, I'd probably go for Michael Keane. But this is still another good investment. Try to snipe him like 2K under or so during squad battles rewards like 22K and hold him until he's like 30K. Now, Hilaire here, the next one. Let's look at him. This is a guy, he's going to have to be really cheap for us to really be interested in him as an 84 rated inform. He's a French striker. However, as you can see here, he's up at like 22K. Again, if you're just picking up one of each of these informs, you could pick him up for like 21, 20K and hold him in the club. But if you're mass club stocking, this isn't a guy I would go for because as a striker in the Eredivisie, he just doesn't hold as much value as the other guys we've been looking at. He's just not, not in the same league as them in those terms. However, let's go to a lower rated player here. We're going to be looking 
in the French league at this Englishman. Let me uh, let me see how much he's going for here. Let's check. So this guy, 81 rated in form. English in the French league is very interesting here. I'm just interested because of his nation and his league. He's 11K right there. I don't know if that's a snipe and I should pick him up. Not really. So if you guys are able to get this guy for like 10,500, I definitely pick him up because then you're, you don't really have any chance of losing coins. Then he's basically close to discard. And with like a, a different big nation in the French league, I think he could be, I think he could be very valuable. I think he's definitely a guy that you should look at, but overall, I think the best of these is Michael, Michael Keane still. And the last guy we want to look at here is Lucas Vasquez. If we take a look, Let's see what his team of the week card. It's his 85 as well, the right back. So he's going to be expensive. I think we're going to stay away from him. But I kind of want to talk to you guys about Michael Keane here for a second. If we jump over to Footbin. So what we're looking at right now is I've basically gone all 83 to 85 rated informs in the Premier League, 20 to 50K. So this is every 83 to 85 inform that's under 50K in the Prem. So basically, as you can see, the cheapest cards here are... Michael Keane and Emiliano Martinez. So Martinez was an investment from last week. So obviously he hasn't risen yet because he's still just fresh out of packs. He hasn't quite been out for long enough. And Keane. Now, the next closest 84 rated in form is going to be Tielemans and Ogmana at 28K. Now, these guys are going to rise minimum to that because that's just how the market works. This, the best substitute is going to become the cheapest option there. Now, Michael Keane, I think, is going to rise to a higher value because he's English in the Premier League, so he gets better links than Ogbonna, and he's Everton, which is better links. And Martinez will still rise as well if you guys want to go pick him up because there aren't goalkeeper substitutes. You have Rui Patricio, who's 86. You have um, Fabianski, who's way too expensive. So Emiliano Martinez is another guy that I think you guys definitely need to check out as well. If we jump over here, you're going to be able to pick him up for really, really cheap here as well. Let's take a look at Emiliano Martinez's price. Emiliano Martinez here. And then make sure you're looking at the 84 rated in form as well. We need to make sure we're picking up the right one. But as you can see, about 23K here. Like you can't really go wrong with that. Okay, I didn't get that one, but if you're picking him up for 23K, you're picking Michael Keane up for like 24, 25K, you're going to be making good coins on these cards. I definitely recommend picking these up. Now, a question a lot of the times on these videos is when do we sell? It's, it's kind of a simple answer to dumb answer. It's basically whenever they go up in price. It's whenever they go up in price and you're happy with the profit, sell the card. Now, it's going to take time as these Team of the Week investments do. Just the longer they're out of packs, the more they're going to go up in price. But it does take time, so don't rush it. And don't go buy a bunch of these if you don't have the coins really to do it. Because otherwise, you're just going to end up losing coins selling on tax when you need your stuff back quickly. So make sure to be patient with these investments. Sell when you're happy with the profit. And if you have any questions, let me know. But guys, that's going to be it for this video. If you did enjoy it, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll catch you in the next video.